It is beginning to look a lot like Christmas everywhere we go, and welcome to the Scott Show Wake Up Call. It is 8 o'clock in the morning, so we do this wake-up call every single day here on the Scott Show. Even on the 17th, where it was recorded, but it was still sent out at 8 o'clock in the morning, folks, so hopefully you guys enjoyed that. Now, we are moving forward on awesome things with 102550 with the Scott Show. And moving into 2018, I'm really excited uh, to give you guys some great ideas on what's going to ha- what's gonna happen and what we're doing. But first, we go to checkiday.com to figure out what day it is today in the wonderful world that we live in. <coughs> All right, it's uh, Catero Ray Tube Day. Don't know what that is. It's Dot Your Eyes Day today. It's Games Day today. <clears throat> it's Go Caroling Day today. Obviously, you can tell I'm caroling like this. It's International Human Solidarity Day, Mud Day, National Sangria Day, and Sacagawea Day. So check that out. Lots of really cool things going on. <clears throat> awesome stuff, and of course, I got a little bit of a tickling my throat still, but I'm feeling great. I'm gonna go do some running today, uh, so that'll be a good time. All right, so we go to the thumbs up and thumbs down. As always, you guys can contribute to this. Go to our Facebook, our SoundCloud, Twitter, wherever you find all the good Scott Show stuff, and you guys can uh, get hooked up with all the cool stuff we got going on here. First thumbs up is for family. Before I forget anything else and make any other thumbs up, thumbs down, I want to make a big mention. Uh, my cousin Jamie is still trying to uh, raise the funds to get her insulin pump. She was uh, diagnosed with type 1 diabetes. So if she needs that insulin pump. If you guys can help her out, her GoFundMe uh, will be on this show's uh, YouTube description. Uh, so check that out. And, uh, you know, family means the world to me, so i uh, take care of them. I dropped a little bit of a donation yesterday uh, to Jamie, and uh, hopefully she's doing all right. Talked to her yesterday, and uh, we need, you know, we need to take care of our people. That's what we do. All right, thumbs down goes to something that happened on Monday, and I didn't bring it up yesterday because I, I must have spaced, but I want to bring it up today. And that is domestic violence. Now, I was outside of the hospital here in Duluth, Minnesota. This guy and this girl were walking down the street and I I heard him screaming. And not only did I hear him screaming, but he grabbed his girl's, um, or what, the girl. I'm not even going to say his girl because that's just silly. The girl that he was walking with, he was grabbing her by the jacket and dragging her pretty much and yelling at her at the same time. So I had, um, you know, with a few friends, we hit the button that said security, check this out. Security came, really nice guy, know him from the gym, and they took care of it. I saw some police officers, um... That is no man that would do that to a woman if she was drunk, take her in a cab, if you're trying to do a good thing, make it look like a good thing, but don't don't be doing that. And he was screaming at her all 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 of his you know, just terrible words. A lot of them me and Kyle use on the Scott and Kyle show, but point being is uh, he was absolutely in the wrong. I did not feel very good about it or safe for anybody there. So, thumbs down for domestic violence. And, dude, first of all, you're an idiot, you're no man, and you're a wimp and a coward. If you're going to treat a girl like that ever, you suck. And I'm going to tell you that, I will tell you that to your face. And hopefully, if I ever see you in the face... It's because I I see you in jail where you belong. 
There you go. All right. Thumbs up. I'm 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 gonna be positive. Try to be positive the rest of the show, but I want to get that out because domestic violence nothing to fool with, and anybody who does fool with that is a fool. There you go. All right. Thumbs up. Cookies. I love cookies and soups. So I'm gonna give both of them because they're foods. I'm gonna give both of them a big thumbs up today. I love cookies. Uh, you know I, I I've been hitting the cookies a little hard this uh, holiday season, but you know. I'll be all right, and uh, I'm gonna go hit the gym later on. Go get that, you know, six pack. I don't have to buy at a store. Um, but cookies and soups, I love them. So I'm gonna have probably get some uh, some soup or some. One of these days, I'm gonna get some Olive Garden soup. I love that stuff. So there you go. Thumbs down. I'm gonna give a thumbs down to people who put together. You know. Here we're going into 2018. So we lost a whole bunch of wonderful people in 2017. Wonderful, beautiful human beings that did not deserve to pass away. However, they did. And a lot of people are putting together retrospectives of their lives and who they were. And the thumbs down is for people who pick really terrible pictures... That then we have to see and it reminds ourselves of who they are. You know, I, I in particular saw one and the picture was, the person was, you know, it's a summer picture but you can pick a better picture of this person. So I'm going to give a thumbs down to the person that picked a bad picture of somebody. It was a female, her, her chest was hanging out uh, and this woman is no longer with us. She deserves more respect than that. And to the person who did that, shame, shame, shame on you for discourage. Oh, I, I'm just, I'm just so upset about this. Ruining, it's just everything. You, you I, I know this person, and this person's just terrible. So, uh, yeah, not happy. Uh, but we're going to go right back to thumbs up. Thumbs up for the uh, show Shits Creek. I could say that in the morning because nobody bleeps me. Um, but Shits Creek is a great show. Um, Canadian broadcasting show. Uh, Dan Levy, Eugene Levy, Catherine O'Hara, Annie Murphy. And the reason I bring this up is yesterday, Annie Murphy's birthday. I missed it. Didn't get to wish her a happy birthday on the show. Doing it right now. Annie Murphy, happy birthday to you. Uh, happy belated birthday to you. So there you go. Um, personal email from business. I hate that. That's my last thumbs down. Uh, I, I just hate when you open up your email and it's like, well, let's just take Annie Murphy for instance, right? So uh, tagline says Annie and it says, hi, Scott. Can't wait to talk to you again. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, I, I know an Annie. Boom, 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 boom. And it's all about, you know, whatever business or whatever non-profit or whatever they're trying to sell. I don't care. Really don't care. I think uh, I saw a political one the other day that said, I'm at jury duty right now. And I'm like, okay, well, I don't know what... Uh, and I looked at it. Political. Again, I don't care. If you make it too personal for me, it's not going to make me any happier to give you any money that I'm not going to give you anyway. There you go. So we start out with our shout-outs today. Most important shout-out of the day. A dear friend, a wonderful friend of the show, Kayla. I want to wish you the greatest of happy birthdays. So Kayla's birthday it is today. Um, and, uh, you know, how, how can I say anything more about how awesome it is? For her birthday today. So there you go. Happy birthday, Kayla. Um, Danielle gets a shout out. Uh, Susan gets a shout out. Jamie, Tara, Nick, and Nadia. Lisa, Jim, both get a shout out. And there you go. Those are our shout outs for today. The winner of the 102550 contest to receive a donation was South Dakota. The Bishop Dudley Hospitality House will be getting a lovely donation from 102550. So check that out. State pick for today is New Hampshire. And two other things before I get going. 
Number one, got my first Christmas card yesterday, so I want to thank the person who sent me the Christmas card. And secondly, if you don't think democracy counts, they did a recount in Virginia. Person won by one vote. Democracy is important. Voting matters. One vote in a big election in Virginia. And they got a new winner. And first of all, ten votes were counted incorrectly and the, the Republican was going to win. Now Democrats can win by one vote. There you go. Now let's hope uh, something good happens and they work harder to get the uh, people behind them and then they can win by a few more than one. All right, folks, so this has been the Scott Show Podcast. I want to thank you all for listening to the Scott Show Podcast. It's the 20th of December, five more days until Christmas. I'm super excited. Uh, You guys have yourselves a Merry Christmas. This Day in History coming up next. And I love doing that show, so we're going to be doing that show, having a whole bunch of fun, and doing a lot of other cool things here on the Scott Show. So Maestro, kick my morning music.